Non-Tox New York, the non-toxic lifestyle in the city and on a budget. Today, a $20 do-it-yourself EMR EMF radiation protective lap desk. Check it out. Non-Tox New York here. You know, I wanted a radiation protective lap desk, but I didn't want to spend over $100 for it and I didn't much like the ones I saw, so I made my own. I've been using it for about three months, and I gotta tell you, it works great. It's comfortable, it's durable, I can use it in a seated position, or I can use it in a reclined position. Plus, it puts some distance between me and my devices, not just in one plane, but in two planes. And I'm not talking about flying either. If this sounds complicated, it's not. This is simple, it's inexpensive, and it's totally worth doing. That's me, kicked back on the couch and using the lap desk first with my phone and then with my laptop. I like the large working surface. I've even got room to add some accessories. I'm thinking a clip to hold papers, maybe a cup holder. Nah, kidding about the cup holder. But, a large surface area on the top means I also have a large surface underneath, and that's where I put my large radiation barrier. Reflectix is basically bubble wrap that's been sandwiched between two layers of aluminum foil. And you can see it being used to block radiation in various applications on the internet. It's a good thing to have between my devices and my... my vital organs. I've got Reflectix on the bottom and I've got some Velcro on the top. This Velcro feature allows me to put some distance between my body and my devices by floating my devices in space. Notice the distance between my belly and my cell phone. This distance gives me some added protection from the emissions coming from the side of my device. It also means I don't have to actually hold my device and I don't have to touch it very much either. So it's not surprising that everyone in my household wants to use the lap desk and I have to make another one. I thought this would be a good opportunity to make a video and show you how to do it too. I start with this Honey Can Do lap desk which is available in your choice of color for about $15 delivered to your door. And I have the Reflectix material for my Radiant Barrier. You can get Reflectix on eBay or Amazon and a big roll cost me about $18. 24 inches wide is perfect for this project and you'll have a lot left over, but if you're like me, it won't go to waste. If you can't find Reflectix or you can't afford it, you could always use what I call milk box foil. It's generally free and I tell you how to get it and how to prepare it in my video called 10 minutes and $2 to protect your family from cell phone radiation. But for this project, I prefer Reflectix because the bubble wrap gives it a cushiony feel and makes it very comfortable on the lap. Along with my very hackable lap desk and my Reflectix, I have some sticky back Velcro, a non-toxic glue stick, a sharp scissors, and a ballpoint pen. So I'm ready to do this and it won't take long. First I'll remove the lap desk from its packaging and I'll remove this cushion revealing the Velcro underneath. Next I'll cut a piece of the Reflectix and I'll trace it with my ballpoint pen. Then I cut and I trim, and soon I'll be ready to glue the Reflectix to what used to be the top of the lap desk, but what will be the bottom of the lap desk when I'm through. This white sticker says that this item is compliant with the new formaldehyde safety standards. And when you see this sticker, it usually means you're looking at particle board. It's reassuring in one way, but it's disturbing in a way too because it's a reminder that formaldehyde is used pervasively. It's in our furniture, 
it's in our clothes now, and it's in the materials we use to build our homes and our office buildings. Because formaldehyde wants to become a gas in our homes, it's one of the reasons indoor air quality has become dangerously poor, and why you owe it to yourself to watch my other videos and learn how to prevent this. Okay, that's looking good. So I'll get my devices, starting with my cell phone. What I'm doing is I'm taking two pieces of Velcro and placing them sticky side up on the lap desk, like this. Then I can just press my phone to the Velcro and it goes exactly where it's needed without my having to measure. And because it's Velcro loop going on my phone and not Velcro hook, I don't have to worry about it catching on clothing or collecting lint. I'll do the same thing with this laptop using four pieces of Velcro and I'll check to see that it's holding well and it does yet I can remove it when I want. And that's my quick and easy do-it-yourself radiation protective lap desk. Hey thanks for watching my video I have other videos and more on the way, so remember to click subscribe so you can find your way back to Non Talks New York. Take care.